Greetings, esteemed viewers. Today, we gather to honor the memory of a legendary soul whose voice and spirit grace the world with its presence. Sinat O'Connor, the iconic singer who left an indelible mark on the music industry, has bid farewell to this earthly realm at the age of 56. As we stand on the precipice of remembrance, let us delve into the details of the upcoming funeral that seeks to pay a poignant tribute to her remarkable life. The solemn occasion of Sinead O'Connor's funeral is slated to take place on Tuesday, the 8th of August. In a gesture that echoes the essence of her existence, an invitation has been extended to the public, beckoning them to gather along the Irish seafront, a place that once cradled her hopes and dreams. It is here, along the sun-kissed shores that Sinead O'Connor called home that individuals are encouraged to bid their last goodbye to the revered singer. A heartfelt statement, emanating from the depths of the O'Connor family, resonates with a poignant invitation. People are invited to assemble along Bray's picturesque seafront, a stretch that bears witness to the ebb and flow of time. The procession is set to embark from the hallowed grounds of a harbor bar, a starting point that carries with it a sense of transition and transformation. As the cordage meanders along the sinuous path of the seafront, it will traverse the entire length of the Strand Road, a journey that transcends mere geography and delves into the realm of memory. The procession will cast its gaze upon the Strand Road's other end, a poignant marker of the passage of time and the journey that awaits us all. It is a tribute that holds a mirror to life itself, a journey that begins, evolves, and eventually leads us to our final resting place. In this poignant passage, the cordage will also honor a place that held a special significance in Sinead O'Connor's life, Montevello, her former abode for a span of 15 years. It is here the devoted fans have gathered, leaving behind tokens of affection in the form of flowers, a testament to the enduring connection that transcends the boundaries between artist and admirer. The words from the family statement resonate with a profound truth, Sinead loved living in Bray and the people in it. In this somber procession, the family seeks to honor not only the extraordinary artist she was but also the profound impact she had on the hearts of those she encountered. It is a gesture that extends beyond the confines of grief, an acknowledgement of the outpouring of love that has flowed from the people of Co Wicklow and beyond. The Garde, ever the guardians of order and sentiment, have extended a heartfelt request to all those who wish to partake in this final tribute. They have asked that those who seek to bid their last goodbye to Sinead O'Connor gather along the Bray Seafront from 10.30 a.m. on the designated day. As we gather in reflection and unity, let us remember that Sinead O'Connor's journey encompassed not only music but also a profound transformation. In 2018, she embraced a new name, Shuhada Sadakat, and a new path as she converted to Islam. Her career, marked by 10 studio albums, is a testament to the power of artistic expression and the ability to touch the hearts of millions. In these moments of remembrance, let us unite in paying tribute to a life that resonated with meaning, music, and the eternal quest for truth. Stay tuned as we honor the legacy of Sinead O'Connor and delve deeper into the chapters that define the tapestry of our cultural landscape.